Okay. Sometimes, even if you're dealing with HR and payroll, you might make a mistake. I know, I've done this before. Did I ever tell you about when I worked at Options Express? I worked at this place called Options Express. It was in Chicago, right in the downtown area. I worked with some very interesting people. I didn't get to know them as well as I had hoped. And I was there for a temporary period of time. And at some point I got another job and I actually recommended somebody else come in and take the job if she wanted to and that, that didn't quite work out. They wanted, well, somebody with different racial and ethnic demographics than the two of us had to take that job instead, right? But I worked there. And part of what I was supposed to do was get together paper mailings through Federal Express connected to, was it Federal Express? No, it was the USPS mailings through the USPS for people to get their quarterly earnings statements relating to their work with them. Now, you may say I wasn't supposed to say the name of the company. Well, back then, there was mandated disclosure, including in terms of hiring practices, right? Just so you know, equal opportunity, employment and all. I made a mistake one day. I was assembling the packages. And in the course of assembling the packages, something in the assembly line got off by one. So the actual mailings were put into the envelopes for the person who actually was supposed to get the actual paper printout that came next. And so at some point in the assembly line, there was a misrepresentation of the chain, the, 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 the actual structure of who was supposed to get what. So if you're just like picking up stapling, putting it in an envelope, sealing it, putting it here, picking up stapling, putting it in an envelope, putting it here. Well, what happens at some point if somebody strategically misplaces one of those statements or if somehow in the printing it wasn't checked in the course of printing them out and compiling them? Something happens. Where did it break down? I mean, if you're a regulator or an auditor or an inspector general or an inspector at all, that is actually a very important question. But if you're just the lady that works the phones and does the mailings, well, what you need to do is understand it as you get there and as you've already put them downstairs to be taken to the post office so they can go out, you realize, oh my gosh, it's mixed up. And I don't know how many of them have the wrong mailings and the wrong envelopes. So we got to get back all of the envelopes and all of the mailings. And we're going to have to go through and make sure that they're put in the right envelopes because right now the wrong financial information is in the wrong envelope. Oh my gosh, I had to deal with this myself. I actually had to deal with this myself, personally. Uh, I fixed it before it got out in the mail. But stuff like that happens. Why would I bring this up? Because if you're in HR and things get mixed up, you have to deal with it. So let me tell you right now, okay, what got mixed up. Transportation. There was a hearing, a congressional hearing, the end of 2017, early 2018 concerning a uh, Congressional Committee on Transportation, specifically about acts of vehicular trafficking, i.e. trafficking people, including in connection with interstate crimes associated with different modes of transportation. There was also a bill around that time proposed by a member of Congress specifically concerning the transportation system and acts of trafficking. Now at that Congressional Committee meeting, Former Senator, now departed Senator, John McCain's partner, who is also in charge of a nonprofit organization that deals with issues connected to trafficking, was, a testif uh, was testifying on the committee. I saw it. I saw it in the Congressional Register. I mean, I saw it on Congress.gov. I tracked the days it was happening. I identified it in connection with other things that were happening, including that would have been listed in the digest of events for the congressional record for that day. What ended up happening with that? See, that's what we're talking about. We're not in Dubai at a conference on tourism. We're in the United States trying to figure out what were the results of that congressional hearing regarding modes of transportation when it comes to interstate trafficking, right? Did you figure that somebody would be too busy mourning to revisit what their actual ambitions were? Okay, okay, well, what's the other matter we got? Education. Did you decide to make somebody else's student your class A for your first lady 
options on your spousal benefits in connection with what's supposed to register in less than a month as an increase connected to executive compensation for former presidents of the United States? That's a direct question. Ma'am, with all due respect, I think the wrong financial information ended up in your envelope and you're going to need to correct the error as soon as possible.